सो वेलकम टू द वेरी फर्स्ट नॉट वेरी फर्स्ट बिकॉज फर्स्ट फॉर द इंट्रोडक्शन तो वेलकम टू द सेकेंड बट इट्स नॉट इवन सेकेंड बिकॉज फ्रॉम दिस एपिसोड वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट लर्निंग सो वेलकम टू द वॉट एवर नंबर ऑफ द रेगुलर एक्सप्रेशन सीरीज एंड फ्रॉम नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट लर्निंग रेगुलर एक्सप्रेशन and i'm sure you have this thing in your mind that regular expression is very hard to learn and the biggest challenge while learning the regular expression is that where you will going to start learning what will be the first step because after having all these gibberish and random characters you will say okay it's very hard to learn it's like uh, playing a chess where you need to focus you need to memorize you need to think ahead but what i am saying about regular expression is that it is very 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 easy and we will going to start from the very small thing and with very small thing i mean to say yes from literally very small thing so we will start from basics and you know learning regular expression is not a game of chess it just a snake ladder game where you will going to learn things you forget that then you go back to my videos or any documentation or any there then you will just remember that thing and you can create patterns just in a few minutes so as i have told you we are going to start from very small thing and the smallest character or smallest thing we have here is a dot so what a dot represent in a regular expression okay so dot means you need to find that means the regular expression we are telling to regular expression that hey regular expression i have given you dot this means you need to find or you need to match each and everything except any line break because this website is very cool if you hover over the character you have given it's just saying that it matches any character except line break so if i yeah yeah so dot matches any character except line break and yes you can see it is matching each and every character but not the new line and if i zoom it out you can see each and every character is individually recognized and have gap in between so this is good so we have told to regular expression match everything but here we are getting each and every thing individually but what if i want to have whole of the line selected i just want to select everything except the line break and if i say select everything select everything in one go not having a individual one so here you just need to provide things like how many times this dot that means dot means matching each and everything how many times it will go so if i say plus you can see instantly instantly it's just completed everything in the line and it matches in a one go so there is no spacing between anything and it has selected everything from here and this line is actually a single line it's not a double line it's just a line break here so that's why if i hover over second part yeah the first one is also selected this means it's a single line and everywhere so here we have plus sign plus is just to match one or more of the preceding thing so what is preceding thing which is dot that means uh, match each and everything i literally want to match dot so here you can see we have a dot before the com and also here after the matches i just want to literally match dot not everything so because dot has a special meaning in regular expression we need to escape it and if you are familiar with any kind of programming language you probably know that escaping is done by backslash so as soon as i type backslash dot here the regular expression is only matching that dot here so this is the power of using 
regular expression you can be explicitly defined and be sure that what you are going to match so dot is fine but i don't want to select each and everything so here comes the new thing which is a small case d and a small case d is going to match any character between 0 to 9 or simply saying d means any digit so it's very easy you can see d means digit so here again because we have told to regular expression that match any digit so wherever there is a digit it recognizes it and we have again a small gap between two digit because we have not selected the one or more condition so again as we know we can use plus sign which is just going to say match any of the digit as it comes in the series and then matches one or more so here it only has one digit so it's selected but even if we have a three in a row then it is selected but because we have a dash here it just recognize this pattern as a one then this as a single and this as a single digit so now it is actually very easy to have all these things so what if i have to select only d literally i want to select d so like d is in created like d we also have here in supported so you just have to type d it's super easy but here is the contradiction you have seen that when we have used dot it is actually a regular expression meaning dot has some meaning and to escape it we are using backslash but here simple d doesn't have any meaning in regular expression but unlike dot if we escape it then it has some meaning so the dot version which is backslash dot and backslash d both are different but you know in regular expression 90 percent cases are with backslash d that means single thing is not having any meaning so it just literally matches that particular thing but if we escape it then regular expression has some meaning but there are some conditions where this is not true like we have the dot we also have some more we will see in the future now i want to select a simple w so we can have a w anywhere we have um okay we can type it <laughs> so we have a w here we have a bunch of w's here we have a word that is started with w so again if we want to match w so just press w and you can see it matches w here and also we have here that's okay <laughs> so again just like d for digit w is for word character we want to have more than one w so again press plus sign matches one or more kind of w so w is good but as we know if we can escape this w then we are going to match any word character so single w is matching only w but backslash w escape w is having some meaning in regular expression and that meaning is we are going to match any word character this means anything from a to z or from uppercase a to uppercase z so this is very nice and again we want to have any word character with one or more so here we have various things it doesn't have any gap it is considered as one element again one element so here it also matches 0 to 9 so word character is actually matching three things one is alphabetic which is a to z capital or small both second is 0 to 9 that means any digit or any numeric and the last thing it matches is underscore so if i say underscore you can see it also has selected but if we provide anything else like this 
it's not going to match because this is not we have told to our regular expression to match it we have just said match anything any word character from a to z from small or capital or 0 to 9 any number or underscore so underscore is just an exception here and this just build up the basic foundation for your regular expression learning stage and i'm sure you will learn things very very smoothly with me and i'm going to post videos regularly each and every day then if you have not subscribed to this channel go and subscribe so that you can get instant notification and obviously for the notification you need to hit the bell icon and like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram to get some of the great updates related to our tutorials and we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye